the piece style that was um, one of the first wigs that we presented. Uh, I gotta tell you, I, don't be surprised if you see me wearing this in our, our shows, especially when I'm in the kitchen, because that's when my hair wilts. But so we've done strength. This is peace. Spirit was one with that little fun, funky, um, little fierce attitude. Epiphany, we have only a couple dozen in any one of the colors. That one, boy, to raise her, to get that beautiful, nice, sleek look, I'm just telling you, would be high, high maintenance that most of us would not be able to do or have the hair to do it. And Honesty was saved for this show. This is the last show of the visit we are not quite sure when the next Gabor wig show will be just because it's been hard for us to fulfill these orders and that's why we keep saying when you see a wig when you see a color grab it and do it because they are going incidentally the wig stands are in the background there you're always welcome to select those as well but honesty has a, a nice contemporary updated look to it and Martino, I think what's fun about this, we'll do colors next, but remember, everything is on FlexPay. Everything has that unconditional 30-day return policy. You can get them at home. You can try them out, do that fierce little attitude, take them to your stylist, have some fun, place in the hair where you like it. Pick your color of choice, though, just because we are getting very, very limited. <laughs> Allison, should we do colors real quickly before I turn um, Martino loose on this one? Okay, should we start with the blondes or the, the browns? Okay, let's start up with the blondes. So the light blonde, we have a couple hundred. This is that medium blonde. Look at how nice and warm that is. Couple hundred there. There's our dark blonde. Last 100, boy, that light brown is so pretty. Final 200, here's our medium brown, uh, final 200. That's probably close to my natural color and what I've been doing on the air. Here's our dark brown. We have fewer than 100. This is black, fewer than 100. This is the medium red, fewer than 100 there. And then the light red, we have fewer than 100 there. Free shipping, unconditional 30-day return policy. Martino, it's fun when we say that um, we have something for everyone under the Gabor we selection. And, but this, the problem is you got to shop while you see it just because it's hard to meet the, the supply chain and the demand. The shipping's our problem. It, yes. I mean, so it's when a they're problem. gone, they're gone. It, it is. And I, I, I give my email out, martino at martinocredit.com. You girls email me every day, and I love chatting with you. But when you say, I need this, and I can't help you, right? So this wig is the same one Inger's wearing. All I did was take you, had me at hello, sprayed a little bit on, and I was able to make it look curly by just doing this. I didn't need a curling iron. I didn't need rollers. This is the one my mother wears. My mother's going to be 84 in June 30th. She's going to kill me when I get off air. But when her hair looks good, she feels good. And I have to tell you, you know, for those of you that don't know me, I've been on each set for 12 years. I'm adopted when I was six months old. Both my mothers, I wound up meeting my birth mother later in life. Their hair was their, like, world. My grandmother's, their hair was their world. My little dog, honey, where's Matza? Like, my little dog, Matza, I swear, when she gets a haircut, she even knows that she looks cute. When your hair looks good, you feel good. And these curls, this volume, even in humidity, even in the wind, even in the rain, and even, thank you, after you wash it, it stays the same. This is Matza, by the way. I had to show her, okay? So Matza is my little baby, and she just got her hair cut not long ago, and I gotta tell you, she knows it. It's like you get a hair attitude when your hair, I love you too, Aww. when your hair looks good. So I'm just saying, <laughs> women have been my world my whole life. I, you know, truth is, real quick, Shannon, I don't know if you know this, I grew up in the Florida Keys when my parents adopted me. Oh. My neighbors were all senior citizen women that used to make me orange tang on the way home from the bus stop, you know? And like, I would stop at everybody's house. I would get a quarter at one house, a peanut butter and jelly at the next. So I just grew up around women. And I knew that making women feel good was my destiny, whether it's through our charity wigs and wishes, whether it's my 12 years at HSN, whether it's bringing you Gabor that gives you perfect hair every day, who doesn't want to wake up and just say, okay, I look like I curled and teased my hair. Now, when you look at Francine, it's the same wig. All she did was run her fingers through it, where I put hairspray and zhuzhed it up. Look at her before and after. Her before is great, but her after is extraordinary. And the day we met, she made it very clear to me with no cameras, no lights, 
no microphones. She looked at me and she said, oh my gosh, I love this. And I went, wow, this is real. This isn't work. This isn't salesmanship. This is empowering women, which is what God brought me to this planet to do. So I'm happy to bring it to you. And Francine, I, I know you can, I hope you can hear me. You look beautiful. I love you. I saw your post on Instagram or whatever it was. I liked it, gave you a little kiss face. And when you turn to the side, could you tuck it behind your ear for me one more time, if you don't mind? Because I just keep pushing that because that's how you know it's good quality. Look, you can't tell it's a wig. If you walk into a wig store and put a wig on your head and try to tuck it behind your ear, you're gonna look like a fool. God forgive me for using that word, but you're just not gonna look like it's your own hair. But Gabor has been around since 1969, 52 years. Started out by making Eva Gabor the fashion diva that she was and is today. And when you look at the back, that split on the before is every woman's nightmare. Seeing her scalp, she thinks she's going bald, but it's really the growth pattern. And guess what? With Gabor, you'll never, ever, ever, ever have that. Yeah. Wind, rain, snow, sun, wash, doesn't matter never coming you're not having it. it you're not you're having a good hair day every day for less right. than the cost of truly a couple blowouts at the salon and then you're yes. lucky if it holds <laughs> you're just, right you're I right mean, you just pray that you don't get that you know menopausal meltdown or summer's coming humidity right? you know it, yeah it, it's true though and and it's i didn't true. realize it that reality you, well and i didn't realize you grew up in the, the florida keys and that's just I did, it in tavernier florida tavernier right Wow. But Martino, it's yeah. really true. And I, I haven't raved on you and your celebrity style, uh, stylist uh, pedigree, if you will, enough. But I mean, <laughs> it's, it's, it's really true. You, you, you get it. You know what real women deal with and you know what celebrities deal with. And quite frankly, it's the SAG Awards tonight. Our very own Curtis Stone is cooking for celebrities. And I can promise yeah, you, sure is. I yeah, would say, well. I bet there are more celebrity than not. I bet there are more celebrities than not wearing wigs. <laughs> you no, know what serious. the truth is? Th that is very true, but I'm going to tell you whether you're Paula Abdul, whether you're Mindy Grossman, or whether you're my girl next door, it's just as important to you that you feel and look the best that you can. And because I get to work on so many women every single day, and now that we live on a farm with like 75 animals and people come here all the time, that's the biggest question. Yes, they feed a goat, they feed a llama, they feed an alpaca, and they're like, what about my hair? And then I'm always out there. It's, you, I wish you could see it like a reality show. I'll take a blow dryer out, a curling iron out. And I just try to teach women to look their best because I know when you look good, you feel good. And Tessa right now was literally able within seconds to take that Gabor wig and she changed it up. Okay, go. Wait, let's, you know, I'm getting a little jealous. I'm in New Jersey, y'all are in Florida and you're doing it without me. So I can't take any credit. It all goes to Gabor and I just love the color. I love the volume. I love the way it frames your face and your cheekbones look higher then your before shot, and I think it was taken today, so there were no fillers done. So clearly it's the hairstyle. And uh, I mean, truly you look beautiful in both, but I love you in the short, sassy, sexy hair. Well, and Martino, it's so funny because I get so caught up on the ease and the comfort <clears throat> and the versatility. Yeah. You're, you're right, it's, it's cheaper than a surgical procedure. And I say that, yeah, somewhat <laughs> tongue in cheek, but let's be honest, if your hair is an older style, is, is your hair making you look older than you are? Bottom line. Well, you know what? This is what happens. A woman gets her hair done. She feels good. And then she leaves. She has a hard time doing it herself. So then she feels kind of okay. Then it grows out and she says, oh God, she winds up putting in a ponytail. Nobody stops her and says, wow, your hair looks great. And you need to hear that. As humans, we need to hear that reassurance from people. We need to hear something like you're nice or you're kind or your hair looks good or your dress looks pretty or I love your shoes. That's just human nature. Gabor, honestly, every day makes you get that affirmation that you can look, feel your best, stand up tall, walk with a spring in your step, get somebody somewhere in your daily walk to say, I love the way your hair looks. Who does your hair? The problem is going to be, are you going to have the confidence enough to say, um, well, I got it from this guy named Martino on HSN, or are you going to just say, thank you? I don't care what you do. I just want you to get the compliments because all of these styles are amazing. They fit all ages. The colors are stunning. They're not that shiny plastic wig, which by the way, you could spend thousands of dollars 
It doesn't matter how much you pay for a wig. It matters who makes it. I have seen this over and over and over, over three decades. People come into the salon. They spend thousands of dollars on a wig and expect me to make it look good. Well, guess what? If it didn't start good, it ain't going to end good. And when you look at Inger, girl, you ended fantastic. Okay? Thank you. <laughs> You're so welcome. I, I love this is medium brown again I'm wearing. And look at the value. It's just, you look how high that is. It's just so good looking. I like the fact that look how Tess and Francine had the same wig on and we all look totally different because their style is completely right. different. You wouldn't believe that it's the same wig, but it is. And look how that's feathered there on the I side. I love it. I Isn't love that it. just gorgeous? It is so fun. Yes. But it's amazing. That, that's an excellent point. I mean, seriously, you know, I'll wear what she's wearing, I'll have what she's having, but you don't look like you're wearing the same, you know, wig. <laughs> mm -hmm. I mean, you're changing it up. You're yeah. changing it up. And, and, and Inky, show again how fast and easy that is. So you so, just find that little tab and then put it on, right? Yeah, those tabs right there at the side. And pull down the back. And I'm going to make sure that it's on my hairline. Can we and show how adjustable this, it, did, it is? A little bit different, too. Can you? Can you show them real quick how adjustable it is? I know our producer, oh, I yes, love her. certainly. And uh, just show how adjustable it is real quick. So if you have a smaller head, you pull it in. If your head is a little bit bigger, you pull it out. So it fits awesome. every size Thanks, head. Allison. And I know it does, because my sister, she has a big head and it fits her head. I love my sister. Oh my gosh. They're my best friends, my sisters. I, See, I listen, told you no secret was safe. <laughs> We you have tell to wrap it up, Shannon. I, I have to tell you, you look spectacular tonight. And I want to say you. congratulations to all the women across America that bought one of these wigs. I pray that you look and feel your best when you're in the mirror. And if you need my help, go to martinocardi.com. You can call or email. I personally respond. I love you all. Stay safe. God bless you.